a senior advisor to Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky resigned along with several other top officials on Tuesday in a major staff reshuffle amid corruption allegations. The departure of officials, including an assistant attorney general, an assistant chief of the president's office, an assistant secretary of defense and five regional governors, followed an announcement by Zelensky Monday about personnel decisions, some today, some tomorrow. The president's office said it accepted Kirilo Timoshenko's resignation as deputy head. Timoshenko gave no reason for his exit, but shared a photo on his Telegram channel showing his letter of resignation on Monday. In a post accompanying the photo, Timoshenko thanked the president for the trust and the opportunity to do good deeds every day and every minute. The 33-year-old father of one child worked in Zelensky's election campaign and has been in his post since 2019, overseeing Ukraine's regions and regional politics. Ukrainian media reported that Timoshenko drove several expensive sports cars during the war but he denied wrongdoing and said the vehicles were rented. More personnel changes are expected in the coming days ahead of the first anniversary of the Russian invasion, which largely hit the pause button on domestic politics as political squabbles were put aside to focus on Ukraine's survival. Zelensky's personnel decisions reflect the central priorities of the state. The president sees and hears society. And he is directly responding to a key public demand, justice for all, said Mihailo Podolyak, a senior Zelensky advisor. A deputy prosecutor general, Alexei Simonenko, was relieved of his post at his own request, the prosecutor general said. Simonenko had come under fire for flying with his family over the winter holidays for a 10-day holiday to Marbella, Spain, according to local outlets. Simonenko has not commented publicly on these allegations. Zelensky said in his nightly address on Monday that civil servants would no longer be allowed to travel abroad for non-government purposes. If they want to rest now, they will rest outside of public service, said Zelensky. Officials are no longer allowed to travel abroad for vacation purposes or for other non-governmental purposes. Deputy Defense Minister Vyacheslav Shapovalov tendered his resignation after a Ukrainian media report accused the Defense Ministry of paying inflated prices for food supplies to the military. The ministry said the allegations were unfounded and the result of a technical error but that Shapovalov's resignation was a dignified act that would help maintain trust in the ministry.